hello guys and welcome back to my channel today we are going to make kanchori kanchori is basically potatoes um viazi kanchori that's how they call it in tanzania so first and foremost we're going to peel our potatoes as i'm doing Kindly, if you're new here, subscribe to my channel, like, share, and comment. And thank you so so much for the um, for um, 1,000 subscribers. I really appreciate your support and feedback. And if you're new here, kindly feel most welcome to my channel. Here we cook local food with a special touch. You should try this recipe for your family, your kids or your friends. It's a very interesting one and delicious. And I'm going to show you every single step on how to make it looks yummy for kids to fall in love with it. You can share with me the next thing that you like me to prepare or cook for you and we can see the outcome of our new recipe Once that is done, we are going to cut them into cubes. Just clean each and every one of them. Let's start cutting. Once again, thank you, thank you so much from the bottom of, of my heart. I really appreciate. Thank you guys. So you cut all of them as you can see over here. Once I'm done, I'm going to place them in our cooking pot. Then add water until it covers the potatoes. Add a little bit of salt, half teaspoon to be precise. I'm going to cover this and then I'll come and see. Let's open and see. You can see it has cooked perfectly. I'll drain the water now. After draining the water, I'll take a 
smash uh, I'll start smashing it is it smash or mash hmm. okay I think it is mash mashed potatoes yeah <laughs> You want to make sure that all of them is perfectly mashed and uh, and smooth. it is done now I'll remove my masha at this point now I'll add carrots garlic four pieces of garlic and ho ho if you have coriander you can as well add coriander but me, I prefer hoho over coriander, and then we'll add onion, and then turmeric, and half teaspoon of salt. Because if you can remember, we had already add uh, salt when I was at the beginning of the video. It did boil with the, the potatoes. So I'm going to mix all of this together. You want to mix it to make sure that it's, it uh, it uh, mixes perfectly. I think I'll need another spatula so that I can mix it uh, properly. Just do like this. It's so easy and simple recipe. You can see the way I'm doing. You have to make sure from bottom to the upper side it is perfectly mixed. It is done now. I'll put it aside. And guys, this is the most crucial part. The next step that you're going to take on this bowl, add two cups of flour, all purpose flour. And then I'm going to add turmeric. Then I'm going to mix that one well. Add water just a little bit. And then we mix it to make a smooth paste. Not too light, not too thick. You have to be very careful this part. If you want your conchores to be perfect, you have to be careful when you are mixing your um, flour paste. I mean with flour paste. I'm going to add uh, food color to make the color brighter. Mix it properly. Mm. 
as you can see it is perfectly mixed now I'm going to put it aside and take my potato mixture apply some vegetable oil on your hands and then scoop your potatoes and start making round balls the way I'm doing and the reason why I'm applying our flour is to make sure that they don't stick on my hands as you can see it's not sticky try to make them into a round shape like small golf balls like that I'm going to repeat the same procedure don't forget to apply some vegetable oil on your fingers I'm going to dip it now in our paste and then cover it with the paste at that point I had already had vegetable oil and it is heated in another pan so I'm going to put them immediately just the way I'm doing it like that look at that guys and the smell in here is amazing I'm going to be very careful and turn them tenderly because it is potato so that it doesn't break and be all over the oil I'm going to turn it nice and slow like that look at that guys looks so yummy once it is brown I'm going to remove it we are done it's so so yummy and the smell is wow look at it guys so so delicious thank you so much for watching see you in our next video bye